Sobalski for EA Sports. Both teams feeling themselves out in game one. Here we go. Two teams looking stark for a win. And we are set to go. Every game critical in the postseason. This one, no different, and we are underway. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Solid check to slow him down. Chekovic is stick handling in his own zone. Center and key. And he denies that great opportunity there. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Denies him in close. I really like to save James because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Here's a short pass to Puckett. Fires it! Makes the glove stop. Takes the feed at the point. And that shot dies in traffic. Hooked away. Hammers it on net. And he blocks a shot. Great defensive play. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Well, he was kind of using his stick as a weapon there, James. He was hacking and whacking. And these are the types of calls that need to be made because they can result in an injury. Moscow's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Scoreless game right now, James, but an opportunity on the power play. You have to find a way to convert. Move that puck quickly and open up lanes. Yaroslavl's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Hammers it. Stones him on the play. Jostling for the puck, but still maintains possession. And that's poked away by Oshaganov. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. The lost connection have to kill off the next two minutes as they have been handed a charging penalty. <laughs> Moscow salivating with a five on three power play. On a five on three with all that ice available and the defensive coverage in the middle of the ice, you have to find a way to pull them outside just a little bit. Sometimes a shot does that. What it does, they react to the shot and the rebound. Guess what? Open lanes. Quick feed to Rocco. And that takes guts to get in front of that one. Moscow's got the puck against the half wall. Play. Here's a pass down low. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Uh, they always say, to be great, you have to get uncomfortable. As we look at this last save, this looks uncomfortable. Stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Moves it to Oshigano. And that's blocked away. Denied by the goaltender. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. Great pressure with the stick. Yaroslavl's got a hold of the puck. Tries to feed it across. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Wheels off to the sin bin for cross-checking. A chance to capitalize here on the power play. An opportunity here to go up by one on the power play. You know they've worked on this in practice. It's something you do, your repetition. This is what prepares you to be big in these moments. Shot right in front, and it backs off a stick in traffic. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Makes a move in front. Big time stop. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Once the stick engages at the lower half of the leg or within the skates, 
You know it's gonna be a tripping call. Big opportunity here for them. They'll have plenty of time to work this five on three. In a five on three, you have advantages all over the ice in the offensive zone, but you still can move. You can move and isolate players. When you do this, you create movement, more opportunity. That's exactly what they have to do. Stop that one. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Oh, what a save in front. Handles the puck at the point. Shot on net. Oh, and he misses that one. Well, momentum is everything in the game of hockey, James. You absolutely want to get on the board first. Nonetheless, you have to get it on net. My God, they really got them hemmed in here in their own zone. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Shot! Big save right at the end! Well, fun start to this one as period number one comes to an end. We've still got lots more still in store. Kids are coming out on the ice here to play. The and we are just moments away from the start of period number two. Still zeroes on the board as we are now underway in the second. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? Well, there's been lots of chances at both ends, but there's no score because there's been some excellent goals, and I'm not sure if the coaches are going to like it, though. There's been a lot of odd player rushes, and I'm telling you, at some point, one's going to go in. Quick shot! With the stop! Out of there! From his own end, he picks up the puck. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Cuts to the front. It's in the back of the net, but it's not going to count as the whistle goes before the puck went in. The lost connection have to serve two for tripping. <laughs> Moscow's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. When the power play is struggling, you gotta get pucks to the net. And you have to have net front presence. Take away the tender's eyes. You know they work on it from a young age. Puck tracking skills, anticipation. Don't let the tender see the puck. Along the half wall with the puck. Chase in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. ready to take the draw here on this power play. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Here he is shot and sunk. Likachev's almost ready to get back on the ice. Moscow's got the puck along the boards. Power play has expired. Scores! And with that, I believe that's his first career playoff goal. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. The Dynamo had the game's first goal, but it's certainly not for a lack of trying here in period number two. Well, James, if you build it, it will come. And they've <laughs> yes. continually been building and finding ways to generate shots. And finally, they cash in. Avery coming up with the puck on the play. Playing big in the moment there. Back to the blue line. Denies him. He got all of it. Yaroslavos gained possession along the boards. Here's a shot. Oh, spectacular stop there. Oh, and he steps up with the great. 
love to stop that one. Here's the pass. Yaroslavl's got a hold of it against the wall. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. And that's blocked. Yaroslavl's got the puck. Slides it across to Chekovic. And he takes the pass. Scores! His first of the playoffs, and the rookie gets it done. Well, every athlete wants to establish themselves as a playoff performer. Well, the rookie, an impressive start to leaving a lasting impression. I love this snapshot from in tight, James, that beats the goaltender. But how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you got to have the will. Yaroslavl's push in the offensive end gets them the equalizer they needed. Yeah, and with impeccable timing too, James. Yeah, the end of the period, you always know you want to maintain your composure, but you also want to create a ton of energy. You don't want to be scored on, but you certainly want to score a goal. They did just that. They got themselves back in evens in this game. Oh, wow! Another great stop! What a great job of trapping the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Less than a minute to go here in the second. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Gives him a tap with a stick, and the referees don't like it. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Scores! It's in the back of the net, and it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. Well, he's been relentless, James, in this playoffs, and you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates. I hear coaches preaching all the time, take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck. Here's a chance. Big save just as time runs out. All right, we've played now 40 minutes in this one, and still a critical 20 minutes still needs to be played. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Final frame is underway here. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? Moscow's trailing in this game because they haven't managed the puck, and they've been cheating offensively. When you're not in good position, you're not supporting the puck carrier, and it goes the other way, you're in trouble. Oh, you know that he felt that one, James. The body is reverberating after it. What a great hit. He was totally locked in on that play. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Listen, Jane, the shooter's in the slot. This is as high danger as it can get, and he challenges. He's set, ready to go in great position and makes the save as a result. Gains the zone through the middle. Great poke check on the reach. Sends it out in front. And that goes off the body and a ride. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, with a one goal lead, there's a small margin of error, James, and to protect it, you can't be in the box. Now they're shorthanded, and they gotta find a way to kill it off. Moscow's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, in a one goal deficit on the power play now, you have to take advantage. You have to find a way to get the coverage moving and find good scoring opportunities. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Not a great penalty to take. I mean, you're down a goal, you're trying to fight to get back in this game, and now you find yourself shorthanded. As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. 
Four on four can be pretty confusing when it comes to coverage. You know that your defense have the forwards, but the forwards have to be able to contain the D as well. So it's complete defense out there. Handles the puck. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. There's another consecutive save. Well, that power play needs to have more urgency. All perimeter movement. Someone has to pay the price and get to the most coveted spot on the ice. And that... Oh, my God! Goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in, James. And that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. <laughs> and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. yaroslavl has got a hold of the puck. Dishes it to Likachar. One on one with the goaltender. <laughs> Gets in on the playoff scoring. Well, talk about embracing the nervous energy. Now he can take a breath, feel good about himself, and let the creativity flow. Looks over his shoulder and the presence of mind to know where everyone is and keeps moving forward. And what a finish that is on net. Yaroslavl's got to feel pretty good about where they're at now here in this third period, Cheryl. I've liked their game this entire game, James. Right from the puck drop, they've been aggressive on the puck, and they can't change it now. They've just got to continue to finish the way they started. Puts it towards the net. Oh, what a chance there! Well, it almost looked like he converted a quick-release shot. He had no time or space, but unable to put it by. He carries the puck up along the wing. On the attack along the boards. Rister, big save. I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James, but man, he flashed the leather. He made the save, no rebound to boot. Late goings of this period. Been a pretty good offensive display, at least for one side. 3-1 is where we sit. Wheels won the draw, they'll look to set up. And it throws off a stick. The Dynamo have gained possession off the wall. From behind the net. Oh, and he wins on it. Forces the turnover in the defensive zone. Yaroslav's been excellent. A shot at the end. Yeah. Yeah. Scores! And the rookie gets his first playoff goal. Well, it's so important to manage the expectation and the nerves when you're a rookie, and that goal is going to do nothing but give him confidence. to resume with the face-off ready to go. And less than a minute to go finally in this one. Shot! And makes the save. Great reflexes, another save. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Shot tipped in front. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Moscow's got to start to recognize a sense of urgency here. They continue to trail late in the third and have had plenty of chances, but can't finish. Takes the puck, and the shot dies in the traffic jam. Great heads up, play to poke it away in the offensive end. Pants desperately calling for a shot before the buzzer. And we are all over with this one. Well, after one team jumps out to the early 1-0 lead, there was the counterpunch that we expected tonight to even the series, Cheryl. Uh, I think we're getting a little bit of a snapshot as to what this series is going to look like, James. And, <laughs> yes. You know, you get down one, and you know that you've got to claw your way back in. you got to split, because if you go down two, that's way too much momentum and runway for your opponent. Well, that brings the night to an end, and we will say goodbye here from rinkside from all of us here at EA Sports.